hello guys and welcome back so now in this video we will add the braking system to our vehicle open up the vehicle controller script and as you know in every game the vehicle stop by the space button so we will do the same as everyone do so first of all let's create a function by the name of apply brakes and in here we will first check that if we press the space button or not so if input dot get key and the key code is dot space then what we want to do we want the present brake force to be equals to the braking force and else if we didn't press the space button then we want the present break force to the 0 F okay and after this when we apply the brakes then what we want to do we will say front right wheel collider dot brake torque and guys let me tell you again that this brake torque and this motor torque the steering angles comes with this wheel collider okay so make sure that you have wheel colliders on every wheel or else the code will not work and also on the main car you have a rigid body applied as i did on the vehicle as you can see so when we press the space button we want the brake torque okay the front right wheel collider the brake torque to be equals to the present brake force and as you know that our vehicle is a four wheel drive so we need to apply the braking force on every wheel so we will say front right wheel left wheel right wheel and back left wheel okay do as i did right here and this will apply the brakes and then we can copy this function name move up after this vehicle steering let's paste that there add a semicolon at the end save the script get back to unity okay we have the vehicle right here we have the braking force let me change this to debug mode so that we see everything in here okay you can notice that our brake force for now is zero and when we press the space button as you can see the brake force becomes 200 and just ignore the player right here okay just ignore the player because how should the player will uh, jump on the space button but don't worry we will add a script and uh, using that script or you can say a security system in which when we are inside the vehicle then we will enable the vehicle controls and when we are not in the vehicle then we will enable the player controls okay now let's move the steering to that side as you can see the steering works whoops the zombie comes let me kill this zombie okay the zombie is dead the vehicle is also moving let's move the vehicle back and now when you press space as you can see the vehicle stop let's move the vehicle there in fast speed and you will notice that when we press the space button the vehicle stop let's move the vehicle backwards okay the vehicle stops and you can notice this very realistic thing when the when we apply brakes the vehicle just kind of moves forward and backward you will notice the as you can see when we apply the brakes the car moves a little bit okay as if this car has suspensions you will notice it as you can see so now our vehicle is working now in the next video we will add the function in which the player can sit inside the car so for that see you guys in the next video